today's video we will discuss about the designing of irrigation canal okay we have a question and we have to design irrigation canal with this given data okay and before this video we have already done uh, uh, design numerical okay and uh, one land canal numerical so you have to see uh, first uh, that video okay and i will keep uh, link of those video in description box okay you can visit so uh, let's see the question first design an irrigation canal from a given data and we have given discharge equal to uh, 50 cumic mannings coefficient that is eta equal to 0 0.025 critical velocity ratio that is value of m equal to 0 0.99 and the slope s equal to six, uh, 16 cm uh, per kilometer okay so this is uh, given data and we have to design irrigation channel with the help of this data okay so let's see the solution okay so uh, let's see now uh, we have uh, first the given value of discharge is uh, 50 cumic and you can say uh, cumic is equal to meter cube per second and the value of q equal to 50 meter cube per second and we have given the slope slope is uh, in other equations we have given generally the slope in uh, this ratio form okay but here in this video in this numerical we have given slope in uh, cm and uh, kilometer okay so these two are the different uh, unit that's why we have to convert these two units in similar unit okay so uh, for this we have to uh, convert cm into also meter and uh, this kilometer is also in meter okay for this uh, we have to uh, divide with 1000 for the converting uh, this uh, cm into meter okay and for this kilometer we have to uh, divide 1000 and as we know uh, for the conversion of cm into meter we have to uh, divide with 100 okay so we have to divide with 100 so this is 100 and uh, for the converting kilometer in meter we have to multiply with uh, 1000 okay so we just uh, multiply with 1000 after um, calculating this value we get the value of slope equal to 1 is to 6 to 5 0 okay so this is the value of slope you can say s okay s equal to 1 is to 6 to 5 0 now we have to uh, take first trial okay for first trial uh, let us assume the value of d equal to 2 meter and we know the critical velocity that is v naught equal to 0 0.55 md uh, to the power 0 0.64 okay this is the basic formula for the uh, critical velocity okay and um, we have to just uh, keep these all uh, value in this formula so 0 0.55 which is constant and the value of m m is given over here m is equal to 0 0.99 and the value of d we already assumed the value of d equal to 2 meter so we just uh, put this value here 2 to the power 0 0.64 after calculating this value we get critical velocity that is the value uh, velocity v naught okay v naught equal to uh, 0 0.848 meter per second okay so this is in meter per second okay then it's okay and now we have to uh, calculate in second step area okay and area can be calculated simply we know um, as we know uh, velocity equal to q by a okay and also we can, we can write the uh, value of a equal to q by b okay and here critical velocity is taken that's why we use b naught so the value of q is 50 given in the question okay and the value of uh, b naught we have already calculated that is b naught equal to 0 0.848 so we just uh, keep this value here and we get the area equal to 58.98 meter square okay and uh, we already calculated the area equal to 58.98 okay but uh, we have uh, the value of b is unknown okay uh, as we know for the calculating area we use both b and d but we already assume the value of d that is 2 meter but we have uh, not known the value of b that's why uh, we have to uh, calculate the value of b with the help of this area 
okay so as we know the area equal to bd plus half uh, d square for the irrigation canal okay for irrigation canal we use area equal to uh, bd plus half d square we have to know this formula okay and uh, we have uh, given and we have calculated value of a equal to 58.98 equal to b and d we have already assumed the value of d equal to 2 meter okay plus 1 by 2 d square and same as this d equal to 2 square and in this equation we have uh, only uh, unknown value is b and after solving this equation we get the value of b equal to 28.463 uh, meter okay now in third step we have to calculate the perimeter and uh, we know the perimeter p equal to b plus root under 5d okay and we use these all calculated value the value of b that is we already calculated 28.46 we keep here and root under 5 plus value of d that is assumed value and take on 2 meter okay and we just keep 2 meter after calculating this value we also get the perimeter that is the value of p equal to 32.935 okay now uh, we have already known the value of uh, a p and b and d okay so simply we can calculate the hydraulic mean depth that is uh, value of r as we know hydraulic radius you can say hydraulic radius r equal to a by p area by perimeter so we have uh, area equal to uh, 58.98 we have already calculated here you can see and the value of p is also calculated uh, 32.93 so we get the value of r equal to 1.78 1.78 meter okay now in uh, fourth step we have to calculate the actual mean velocity that is the value of, value of b okay and uh, as we know the value of b equal to c to tender r s okay this uh, formula is given by kinle and the velocity b equal to c to tender r s and the value of c is uh, we have unknown okay but we have the value of r uh, we already calculated the value of r is uh, 1.78 and also the slope slope is uh, given over here in the position 1 is to uh, 6 to 5 zero. but we have only unknown value is c okay for c uh, we use the formula for the calculating value of c we use this formula c equal to 23 plus uh, 1 by eta plus 0 0.001555 by 5 uh, to the whole um, by 1 plus 23 this is plus 23 plus 0 0.001555 uh, uh, by 5 into n by root over r okay and we have already this all value is known 23 plus 1 by eta the value of eta is already given in the question that is 0 0.0225 okay so we just take this value plus uh, 0.00155 by s and the value of s is we already calculated 1 by 6250 here 1 by 6250 okay so we just keep here and 1 plus 23 plus 0 0.00155 by s and uh, s is also 1 by 6250 into uh, eta by root under r and the value of eta is also given in the equation that is 0 0.0225 as we already seen and uh, by the root over r and the value of r is uh, also calculated that is the value of r is 1.78 so we just keep 1.78 and after the calculating this value we get the value of c equal to 49.7 okay and uh, we have to use this value in this equation okay so after uh, calculating this value of c we uh, keep this value over here so the value of velocity that is b equal to 49.76 that is the velocity uh, value of c uh, root over r s r the value of r equal to 1.78 and the value of s that is slope is already calculated 1 by 6250 and this value becomes 0 0.84 meter per second okay after calculating okay and you can see here uh, the actual mean velocity you can say b a okay actual mean velocity is uh, nearly equal to this critical velocity okay you can see here 0 0.84 and this is also in the 0 0.84 okay so here uh, nearly two digits are uh, same okay so this is the uh, nearly equal velocity 
we found nearly very uh, near this value okay that's why uh, this value is okay okay and we uh, don't need to uh, trial next next trial okay so this completes in uh, very first trial okay so this is all about uh, this numerical if uh, the value of this actual mean velocity is not nearly equal to this critical velocity then we have to uh, do second trial okay but here in this uh, numerical uh, the value of both that is critical velocity and actual velocity is uh, nearly nearly equal okay that's why uh, we don't need uh, for the second trial okay and this completes the numerical thank you very much see you in uh, next video hope you guys are understand well if you have any queries please comment down below thank you very much see you in next video okay and i have uploaded different value related to our civil engineering as well this irrigation uh, engineering and different uh, numerical related to our uh, irrigation engineering as you can say uh, design of sada fall okay uh, design of uh, guard bank or you can say bail bond okay and uh, different numerical related to uh, irrigation engineering and that was um, very important for our final examination so you can simply visit from the channel okay thank you very much see you in next video